Fans getting ready for day two of their fan fest in downtown Miami. Yesterday was marked by live car runs and entertainment, but today all eyes are going to be on the Grand Prix, which is happening in Austin, Texas. That's right. Local 10's Trent Kelly is live in downtown Miami with what they've got going on. Hey, Trent. Hey there, Nikki and Todd. Yeah, a heck of a lot going on uh, here in downtown Miami. First, though, let me start with this. Check this thing out. How many times do you get to stand next to a car like this? This thing, believe it or not, uh, Nikki and Todd, it can easily reach speeds of up to 200 miles an hour and then some. And it's just one of the handful of Formula One race cars out here at Bayfront Park. They're all out here for the big F1 Fan Fest going on this weekend. The event officially kicking off yesterday with a live car run right here along Biscayne Boulevard. There were also several giveaways along with music, food, and even some F1 inspired art for sale. Miami now becomes just the fifth city in the world to host one of these F1 Fan Fests. And it comes at a time when the city is currently in talks to host a Grand Prix race right here in the streets of downtown Miami. Now, officials believe an event like that would help to draw in more visitors and generate revenue for the city. And as you can imagine, most of the motorheads here at the F1 Fan Fest, well, they say they would be all in for a big event like that. We like all racing events, really. We've been able to travel, you know, different parts of the country and Canada, see different racing events. So we're really excited about maybe having one here in Miami. The atmosphere is fantastic. I'm a true Formula One fan, and it's about time Miami has got it together. Now that idea, though, is not sitting well with some people who live here in the downtown area. Some have already complained about the possible noise that would be generated from holding a race out here. Another concern is the traffic. That's because officials would have to close down a good portion of Biscayne Boulevard, potentially for days as they prepare for a big race like that. So nothing set in stone just yet with the city still in talks with F1. The earliest any race would happen out here, I'm told would be 2020. Now back out here live, we should mention this is the last and final day here for the F1 Fan Fest. The uh, gates here at the front of Bay, uh, Bayfront Park will officially open here at noon. Uh, and in a couple of hours, they'll actually be showing that big Grand Prix race on some of the big screens here. That starts at 2 p.m. So a uh, lot to check out here at Bayfront Park before the doors officially close tonight at 7. We're live in downtown Miami. Trent Kelly, Local 10 News.